So what do we Blue know about Green this? Green Mountain. Ever since David Einhorn came out swinging, what was it, three years ago, they have lost their groove. Yeah, yeah. So this is a huge deal. I mean, the premium, I haven't, I haven't really tracked the numbers. It's like 60, 70 percent premium from the close wow. Friday. So the Friday they were closing it, they were, they were trading around 50 something a share. This is, I think, 90 something a share, the offer. Wow. So a pretty huge jump. Uh, and JAB is, you know, positioning themselves as a huge rival, I guess, in, in, in to either to Starbucks or just to the, the whatever the dominant coffee makers there are in the United States because they bought a while ago I think they bought Caribou and they bought some of the other big companies uh, the Sara Lee coffee business I believe is inside JAB as well the old Sara Lee business so they're just enormous now in the coffee space here in the United States. Well remember Green Mountain you know in the beginning they thought they were they were the only ones with the sort of K-cup model but since those barriers of entry dropped and everyone got in that space they lost their specialness. So unless there was sort of a, of a deal like this, they were struggling to really have any growth opportunities. Right, and I, you know, there were also complaints from people that simply said, it doesn't taste all that great. That like, is a problem. No, that's a problem. If you <laughs> sell coffee that doesn't taste very good, it is oh. a fundamental problem in your business. I, I, you know, I'm not a coffee connoisseur, but it, it to me wasn't quite as good as uh, other coffees I had had, you know, whether it was Starbucks or, or others. So anyway, that, that was an issue. Do we know, is this a cash deal, stock deal? I haven't mix? actually gotten a chance to we look at it. We don't know yet? I don't know yet. Okay, great. This is, though, a 78% premium. And remember, this is a company that has struggled. So when we look at M&A over the last couple of years, God, the premiums that we see paid, why? What is so special? I think I think that they're putting themselves in a position where there aren't a lot of other rival. Well, there's one other rival. There's one main rival with Starbucks. So that I think also Green Mountain shares are down quite a bit. A so ton. Green Mountain, their their board probably wanted to get something closer yeah. to where they used to trade. So I think those are the two explanations. And it's a preemptive price, basically. Right. It scares away anybody else who might be interested. Exactly. I don't know. I don't know if there's a go shop yet. We haven't gotten a chance to look through that either. Yeah, yeah. So maybe okay. there's some others that could. Okay, so come we'll into follow it. that.